Okay, so it's hard, you know, these days to keep up to date with the latest phones and all the gadgets. Lee Cruz might just have some help for us. Well, unless you're a kid these days, they know all <laughs> the stuff. Lee joins us from right here at the station with a look at some of the latest cutting edge technology. How do you do, Lee? He is the forgotten parent, as we know, and we thought we'd be nice to throw him a bone and nothing better than technology. We got Steve from uh, Verizon that are with us. Good to see you there, Good buddy. Good to see you as well. Thanks okay, for me. so what can we get, Dad? All this? right, so you're, you're looking at this, you're like, well, this looks like a normal laptop, right? Well, this is the Google Pixel Book. I love this for a few reasons. Check out all the different ways you can use it. So this is entertainment mode. Of course, I started with it in laptop mode. So now it's a touch screen. We can go ahead and play videos, things like that. I can flip it around in tent mode. So now I can set it on a table and make it easier to, you know, let's say Dad's looking up some YouTube videos on how to actually fix something in the house. This is a great way to do it. And if he's worried about space, Look how slim this gets. Yeah. And now it's a tablet, and we can use it just like that. So I love it. Uh, like I said, very nice and portable. Uh, 10 hours on battery life, so it's going to last them all day as well. Nice. All right. This Next is up, interesting. This is not to hit people with. Yeah. So <laughs> this is the uh, uh, LG Rolly keyboard. Check this out. This is for the dad that has trouble typing on his smartphone. Those keys get pretty tiny. He can roll mm -hmm. out a full keyboard. It's actually connected to my phone here, and you can see as I start typing, it's going to go ahead and pop up on the screen. Now I'm not actually typing anything uh, that you can read, but right. um, just to prove the point here, and then when he's done, he just folds it back up. It's magnetic, puts it in a, a bag, puts it in his car, wherever it is, and now he's got it on the go. Yeah, yeah the there you go. If you want. Look at that. It's right in the coat pocket. Gone. All right, so next up. This is the Belkin Boost Up. So this is a wireless uh, charging puck. So uh, the problem we run into today is the fact that all these different phones have all these different types of charging cables, right? So mom might have an iPhone, dad might have an Android. They don't use the same charging cables, but we can unify the family with wireless charging because now your iPhone 8, iPhone X, as well as uh, the Android devices all charge wirelessly. So you can just put your phone right on the puck. The puck is actually charged into the wall. So the idea here, don't have to worry about futzing with the cables and uh, the whole family is unified. That hurts my head. <laughs> I don't understand this. How do I transfer energy from that to that through the air? It's science. It's magnetic resonance. That's not yeah. science. That's magic. <laughs> that is magic. I absolutely. don't get that. I <laughs> swear to you. I mean, shouldn't I see an arc? Shouldn't there be right? Smoke? No, you're right. And you can, the water does. I mean, nothing like messes with that. It's I it do is not crazy. Get that. That's okay. pretty cool, though. All right. What All else? All right. You last but not least, if your dad is like mine, uh, what did we hear growing up? Were you born in a barn? Uh, so if dad's concerned about energy use or just would like to not have to lift a finger from the couch to actually adjust the heating and cooling, check this out. With the Nest thermostat, he can go ahead and use this nifty app. And you can see there, my place is at 77 right now, so I'm going to have to pop on the air a little bit before I get home. Uh -huh. you, can, you can adjust it remotely. The other nice thing is for energy savings. This will actually save you about 10 to 15% on your energy use. It's going to automatically adjust based on how the family uses heating and cooling. And when you leave the house, when it sees your smartphone is left, it'll automatically either turn off the air conditioning or turn off the heating. That way you're obviously saving on it. It sees you come home, pops it back on. Okay, and but could I control that remotely from Absolutely. outside yeah. of the house? Too? So I'm I'm obviously not. If my I wanted right to now, cool the house down, yeah. oh wow! I can just click on it. You can see here on my uh, modes. Yeah, I can go ahead and turn the air conditioning on if I wanted to. All right, great great ideas. Again, if you want to learn more, go to uh, VerizonWireless.com or any local store. Steve, thank you, buddy. Thanks for having me. All right, ladies, we'll send it back to you. It's interesting yeah. stuff. All sorts of stuff you never knew you needed, right? Indeed. <laughs>